The Discourses of Christ of the Last Days. Words on how to experience failures, falls, trials, and refinement. Excerpt In their belief in God, what people seek is to obtain blessings for the future. This is their goal in their faith. All people have this intent and hope, but the corruption in their nature must be resolved through trials and refinement. In whichever aspects you are not purified and reveal corruption, these are the aspects in which you must be refined. This is God's arrangement. God creates an environment for you, forcing you to be refined there so that you can know your own corruption. Ultimately, you reach a point at which you would rather die and give up your schemes and desires and submit to God's sovereignty and arrangement. Therefore, if people do not have several years of refinement, if they do not endure a certain amount of suffering, they will not be able to rid themselves of the constraints of corruption of the flesh in their thoughts and in their hearts. In whichever aspects people are still subject to the constraints of their satanic nature, and in whichever aspects they still have their own desires and their own demands, these are the aspects in which they should suffer. Only through suffering can lessons be learned, which means being able to gain truth and understand God's will. In fact, many truths are understood by experiencing painful trials. Nobody can comprehend God's will, recognize God's almightiness and wisdom, or appreciate God's righteous disposition. When in a comfortable and easy environment, or when circumstances are favorable, that would be impossible. 